Hello everyone, Robert Rambles here and welcome to WoW Classic and the Season of Mastery. Today we are going to be doing the Scarlet Monastery Library Dungeon. We have an at level group including myself tanking. We have a level 36 human priest healing. And for DPS we have a level 30 human rogue, a level 36 gnome warlock, and a level 35 human paladin. So... No one is too out-leveled, no one is too under-leveled. It should be a good time, and still relatively challenging. Assuming we can survive the Hallway of Despair. Ooh, let's get our Health Stone. And put that somewhere where we, we might be able to actually get to it. We also need to move around some of our keybinds here. There we go. Should be good. Well, we were incapacitated immediately. Always fun. Once we get a couple sunders on these guys, then they might actually want to stay on us. Obviously, if we're not getting hit very much, we're not going to have a lot of rage to do anything with. Everyone looks good. I I'd rather not be locked in combat. I'd like to be able to charge, but... Apparently we're just going to be locked in combat. If that's going to be the case, I'm just going to go into defensive stance. And maybe we'll try... Oh, we're not going to do that. I want to let her path away. There we go. Yeah, they really like incapacitating us. We're going to blow Challenging Shout here. And we will kind of hope for the best. Yeah, we need to get back here. This one's going to just be uh, sitting on the healer, which we, we really can't have that, so let's clean that up a little bit. Healer's at half mana, which is pretty good considering everything that's going on. I'm impressed that I'm still alive, so... I realize that I'm just kind of backing up a little bit further and further down this hallway, so I'm going to stop moving around and we're just going to hope that we don't get any more ads, but I I'm pleasantly surprised that we survived that. And it might be a good idea to let our healer get some mana back. Let's see. She's not drinking, so... Gonna assume that if you're not drinking, then you don't really want mana back that much. And 
that incapacitate they have is uh, pretty detrimental to being able to hold threat. Well, that's a nice one-handed axe upgrade. We are currently using a one-handed axe. So I think I'm going to go ahead and take this. I can type, I swear. This I'm probably going to want to pull a little bit more strategically. Fantastic. <laughs> but yeah, that is a cool looking axe and it's a surprising upgrade. I've had some pretty good luck in this season of Mastery as far as random drops have been going. Uh, which has not always been the case. I think we want to... Oh, this is going to be a little rough. I'm going to do this. And we're going to run back here and try to line a sight. Yeah, just everybody, basically. <laughs> uh, how do we want to take care of this? I think the same thing here. We're going to pull her out. Let's bring her around the corner here. This is probably not how everyone clears this room. There are probably more exciting ways to clear this room, that's for sure. Uh, but this is kind of how I like to clear it. Especially when you don't know some of the people in your group. Just to kind of get a feel for how everyone is. 
Everyone here seems like they could probably handle bigger pulls, obviously. Uh, let's loot, though. Alright, now we can safely move over here and maybe do some bigger pulls. I was kind of thinking this one would come down here, but she doesn't really seem very interested in doing that. There we go. Alright, let's take a look at the room here. I think he's the only one in this room. Paladin is drinking. Alright, let's let everybody get the mana that they would like to have for this. At least don't do any damage. Uh, yeah, that's fine. You don't need to do too much damage, man. It's totally fine. Uh, yeah, I think I'm just gonna go in and maybe we just throw down a thunderclap before we change stances. We have a, a point in tactical mastery now, so... Pretty sure we got threat distributed to everybody here. Uh, looting while the boss is still alive. Who is looting? <sighs> no, it's fine. We got a staff that seems useless for anybody in the group. Plus 60 attack power when fighting beasts. I guess that would be okay for who? I, I actually don't think that would be okay for anybody. Um, I'm trying to think about it, but yeah, it doesn't seem like anybody would really benefit from that. No bonus stats on it unless you're fighting beasts. So. Hammer of Justice. Of course it's Hammer of Justice. One of my favorite Paladin abilities. She took off rather fast. The good thing about a paladin, though, is that when they pull threat, you don't have to worry about them melting. Like, they can safely tank an enemy. Kind 
kind of want to pull her back a little bit, if I'm being honest. She obviously does not want to be pulled back. Oh boy, here we go. Alright, so far so good. Even when we pulled extra, it has not been a big deal. Easily handled by the group. Great job, guys. Okay, well, we can either think about this for a minute or we can just rush in. Uh, we could also pay attention to the door behind us and know that that's a real thing. And man, that that uh, hammer of justice, though, every pull just kind of preventing us from getting the kind of aggro we'd really like to have. Doing okay in this pull, though. I'm not sure how we want to handle the chest. I mean, I don't really want it anyway. Usually it's just garbage in the chest. So we're going to pass. And I kind of think I just want to pull these guys outside of the room. Because I really don't know what else is going on in there. Well, there was a bubble that went off. Thankfully, it wasn't a heal. It could have been worse. Luckily, we'd already cleared this room out. Okay, we've pulled somebody who is interested in casting fireballs at us. Let's try to get her out of the room. There we go. Get a nice little shield slam in on her there. I really don't think I want to charge in here, that's the problem. Maybe, maybe we just play the safe and I hide over here for a second. I mean, the Paladins do enough damage to pull aggro, so can't be slouching too, ma too badly.
Yeah, see, we have a side room here. How do we want to handle the side room? I think I'm going to charge into the side room. There's three guys in there. Let's do that. And then let's uh, bring them all out here. And we'll just kind of bunch them up in the hallway. That's good, right? I'm noticing that we're missing and being parried quite a bit. Weapon skill is almost maxed out, so it shouldn't really be that. Uh, do I dare charge in here? Yeah, I think so. Anything interesting in the room? Uh, no treasure, so no, not really. Alright, I guess we're going this way. Got some people off in the wings over here. Let's start by pulling some of them out. We probably could use our shield slam when they're targeting themselves with a heal or a bubble. That would be a good time to use it. I'll have to keep my eyes open for that. It's not very impactful either way, but it could be good practice at interrupting. Though to actually do that efficiently, I'd probably want to have my interrupt keybound. Uh, right now we don't. Could put it over here, that would be okay.
Alright, now we can come into the room a little bit. These guys, though, same thing. I'm going to pull them to our side over here. Alright, and same kind of pulls here in this room. Let's bring them back here. I probably could have just ran in for that last one. Uh, I don't think that room has anybody else in it.
At this point, I think it's fine just to let the piloting tank one. Don't really see any harm in it, and it's probably better than me frantically trying to pull thread off of it. I'm okay with it. Uh, we're still in combat, that's incredibly unfortunate. Kinda wanted to get my charge off there. Feel like we are quickly approaching the last room. Oh, I noticed now that our healer did go AFK for a second. I'm really good at always paying attention to my chat box, as you guys who've been around the channel for a while know. Really good at paying attention to that chat box. Been trying to get better, obviously, when I'm in a group. Oh man, I wish I had time for armory tonight. I wish I had time to do it tonight. This did feel like a quick run. There we go. We'll use our challenging shout here to try to get the red on everything. See how that goes. Tomorrow I can commit to. I can commit to an armory run tomorrow. I wish I had time tonight. I definitely am a huge fan of Five Men Dungeons, and I had the long period in my life where I would get onto World of Warcraft, and all I would do would be to like grind out Five Men Dungeons, and always had a ton of fun, whether I was doing it solo or with my friends. Uh, yeah, it was always great, but these days I don't really allocate that many consecutive hours to the game, uh, especially in the evening when I have a lot of other stuff that I want to do. I'm going to try to pull these guys back here and hope they don't come with the fourth guy. Uh, but at this point, they probably will. Yeah, it came with all of them. Big surprise. Big surprise, we got them all. There's a lot of trash in the library. I I'm really kind of like noticing that for the first time. Alright, last boss room. Everyone looks pretty good as far as health and mana goes, so let's go in, shall we? You will not defile these mysteries. Oh, here we go. Arcanist Duan. Going? Looks like he's doing a little arcane explosion. Really wants to be on our paladin, buddy. I wonder if he's got Righteous Fury on. Could have. He could have it on. 
We got sheep, Burn so that's fire. good. Burn in righteous fire. Seems like something we could have interrupted. Okay, sheeped and then burned by the righteous fire. Seems appropriate, yeah. We have four sunders on him. I just have a hard time believing that we could lose aggro with four sunders up unless he had righteous fury on, but what do I know? Doesn't show that he has it up. Guess he is just hitting that hard. Illusory... Rod. That's a pretty good looking staff and the robe of Doan. We will greet on that and pass on the other. And that guys is Scarlet Monastery. We definitely won't forget the key. We need that to open up the armory. Yeah, very smooth run. Very good time. Gildan, thank you for coming along. The rest of you guys, thanks for being here. Really appreciate it. Thank you guys for being here and for watching and for all the support you've shown the series and the channel. It really does mean the world to me. So take care of yourselves I out there and take care of each other. Here. And we'll I see you back in Azeroth sometime soon. Bye now.